One day, suddenly uh, at night, everything turns around in, in on me, and I feel like emptiness, and I feel questioning myself. So many questions, like. What am I doing in this world? What is this life for? And I feel like confused. And, and then I start to think like, I think there is something that I have to do in this life. So I, 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 I start to wonder if I need to talk with someone, but I feel like that in this world, no one can, is going to help me. And then I think, no, I think there is a God. So I was, I, I was like, how can I find God? Where is God? I want to talk with God. One day I saw my sister praying and then it really touched me, you know, when I saw her praying I was, wow, I think she's talking with God and I want to talk with God also. And then I start to looking about things about Islam and then I search a word in the internet and he said, La ilaha illallahu Muhammadur Rasulullah. I didn't really know the meaning of this, but uh, I, I, uh, I, was, I feel so comfortable with this word. And I try to memorize it. And every night when I go to sleep, I, 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 I was, because I feel like I was lost in this world and I start crying. And every time that I go to sleep, I just say, La ilaha illallahu Muhammadur Rasulullah. I feel so comfortable and then one day I told my sister you know I know a word in Arabic I know a sentence I know la ilaha illallah Muhammadur Rasulullah and then she said you know you say this when you convert to a Muslim and I was like so I'm a Muslim so uh, and then I start to feel like that God was guiding me to find the truth about my life and the true path so it was like I feel like some, I feel like Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, He opens my heart. Yeah, out of, <laughs> in one night like that. La ilaha illallah Muhammadur Rasulullah is the declaration of faith in Islam. It means that there is no God worthy of worship except Allah and Muhammad is His messenger. But before we left Hong Kong, we also met Wing Zi Chang a certified accountant in an international company who also told us her story. Um, my work gave me an opportunity to work in London for two years. So I went abroad, so I settled my family, got my driving license, and I want to experience what is life. I want to, to really look for life. So at the beginning, uh, me and a few um, girlfriend uh, try to enjoy the European life. We went, we start to go dancing, clubbing, drinking, and stuff like that. Just the normal European life. But slowly I realized that actually it's not good for the woman. I see some very good and innocent uh, friends. They um, start to have multiple relationships. Sometimes I uh, want to take a cab with a girlfriend uh, at night, but she just disappeared after seeing a guy in the pub. Then I realized they are not happy at the end. They are being abused and they are just destroying themselves and they don't have any happiness at the end. I start to think this European or Western lifestyle that we always feel superior but I cannot find an answer within that. I took a flight to Florida and I spent seven days fishing by the pier and I start to look for religion with the Bible on my left hand and uh, Fortress of the Muslim is a prayer book on my right hand. So my religious journey started. So after then after half year of uh, reading I uh, kind of confirm Islam is the truth. It really fitting to my values. Um, so then I embrace Islam. 